Hey guys, my name is Notch, and welcome back to Pikmin. In the last episode, we had a really good day, and we got three ship parts, but we didn't get all of them, in fact. The last one is just barely, re barely sleeping beyond our base. So, for this episode, it's going to be a double day like we did before, by going down into that, into uh, the distant spring, but we're ending the day early and going to the new area. So, we're close to the end, guys. Just two more ship parts, and that will be the end of the game. I love this game. This game, I love it. It is right there! Are you freaking kidding me? <laughs> oh, boy. Alright, let's sprout these five. Oh, boy. That's, that's actually quite funny. I'm so glad that that little piece right there counts as base. Alright, let's get it. I want to check something real quick, so every single one of you friggers are back. Yeah, no. Once you take out the Smoky Prog, that's the, that's the one chance. What the frick are you doing? I can't- Bro! Get it. Nice! Oh. Well. Day 20. Requires 20 Pikmin to carry it. What a perfect way. There it is. The Chronos Reactor. It's Chrono Trigger! This reactor changes permutation permutations in the space-time continuing into pure energy. Basically, it's like a big rubber band. Alright. I've recovered 29 out of 30 ship parts, increasing the dolphin's capabilities. My search can now cover a wider area. What the heck was that noise? But anyway, look at that! Oh. Alright. Well, let's call it quits there, and go to that new area. Now this one's a special treat. Because there's a little secret, there's a little easter egg, once you unlock the final area. 20 days since impact. At last, but a single ship part remains. Since I've recovered 29 of the missing parts, the dolphin's power is near capacity. In the forest depths below. I see a region where the final part must lie. Clearly, this is my final trial. My life support fails in 10 days. COURAGE! Yep. Olimar, you're close. It's so close, we can feel it, we can taste it. Alright. Look at that! It's a meteor shower. This will only happen once you unlock the final part of the game. It's a nice little thing. So, 100%, 100%, 100%, and 100%, and took down each of the boss, bosses, in each area. All that leaves is the final trial. So, let's do it. Now, I love the music here. Wait for it. All right. Well, here we are. So, starting off, we have the we have a crimson, golden, and ivory. Oh no, ivory's the white one. What's this one? I have no idea what this candy pop butt is. I want to. Ah, I don't want to know. All right, so starting off, there are no enemies here. It's all puzzles. So what we're gonna do is we need to get our blues. Let's just say 35 blues can handle this. And we're gonna go across the water over to this bridge over here. 
this will open the way up for bomb rock, bomb rock carriers and I should have brought more blues. I will be right back. I will be right back on getting it. So this day will just be a start of what's to come. It's only just filling out, um, completing puzzles to the actual main thing in this area. We're not gonna... Because this is where the final boss is. We're not gonna do that quite yet. We're just gonna get... E we're gonna have access to it. Alright. If we're quick enough, we could handle the boss. But at the same time, I'm not confident enough to take it down one day! Uh, whoa, whoa, whoa! Game froze there for a moment. I'm gonna need yellows. Wait, what the heck is the... Uh, what is the fire in the flames? Oh, I know what the fire in the flames are. Yes, yes, yes. I'm gonna need ten reds for that. So we'll just do that real quick. Alright. So, going over here. That is dangerous for Olimar to go in there by himself. Alright, they completed the bridge here. Navigate throughout this area here. Bring them all the way over here. There's a cardboard box. Dismiss them, and they will start pushing it. Pretty, pretty good! Now, for the yellows. We need to go over here. Well, let's just get our yellows real quick. I say about, you know what, 10 yellows sound really good. So let's get our 10 yellows. Alright, pretty good. Alright, they finished that bridge, I'm pretty sure. Uh, throw the yellows over here. Every, every single one of the Pikmin has a major part to play in this day. That's really nice, using using every single Pikmin to solve this puddle, puddle, puzzles! end of the game. It's actually quite sad. I really, like, despite all the ups and downs, I love this game. This game will always hold a special place in my heart, and at some point in the future, I would want to play Pikmin 2 for you guys. There are other games that I have been considering, like, um, uh, the Persona series, since uh, Persona 3 has just got a new remake on the way, yeah! A Persona 3 Remake! I'm so excited! Persona 3 Remake! There we go! Um, so I have been considering like Persona 4 Golden, or Persona 5 Royal, or even Persona 3 Portable. But that game is just so long. Maybe I'll do it at some point in the future and there's just like, too much dialogue. Or something, but I am a huge fan of the Persona series. So, maybe at some point. I don't know. Dude, come over here. I want to get my numbers. Okay, so actually, I didn't show this off. Um, well, I did, in a way, but I technically didn't as intended. If Olimar sleeps next to Pikmin, they will pick him up. Hey, oh. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Let me, let me show you again. Alright. Uh, freaking even changing the camera, really? Damn it! I'm trying to show this off! Alright, the Pikmin will carry Olimar back to the Onion. What will happen if Olimar will go underneath the Onion, you may ask? Nah, he will just smack his head! <laughs> Alright. I am not gonna need this much blue. 
Actually, blues won't be part of the... You know what? I'll just keep 10 blues so I can include every single one of the Pikmin uh, for this uh, final boss. I'll get 15 yellows and the rest will be reds. Trust me, you're going to need a bunch of reds for this. 75 reds. Alright, so... I think we can smash this out. I'm calling it. Let's, we got this. We got this. You know what? We got this. Dude! You know what? Screw you. You're dead. You're an idiot. Alright, over here is a gate. We need a boss down to get him. What the hell are you doing? That is the easiest gate to take down. Look at that. Don't go in the middle quite yet. What you're gonna do is you need to go all the way around and break down this door. Trust me, you need to break down this wall. Okay, so... We're gonna have every single one of you call it quits there. I want wanna get my yellows ready. There's a bunch of bomb rocks up here. This is gonna play a crucial point in this fight coming up. Get as many bomb rocks as you can. Hey, whoop, 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 whoop. Guys, what do you think you're doing? Alright. Call you off there. You walk in the middle. Hey, buddy, how's it going? All right, this is the final boss of Pikmin. This is Emperor Bulblax. This guy, he's terrifying. I can't even stress enough how terrifying this guy is. All right, so what you're gonna do is, you're gonna have a Pikmin go there. He's gonna throw the... Alright, well never mind then. He's gonna eat the bomb. And... Oh boy. Get the hell... Shit! Oh, okay. I... Screwed up a lot there. What you're meant to do is have a Pikmin throw the bomb rock at its tongue. Call him back, 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 call him back. Oh my god! What are you do? What the frick are you doing? Alright. I'm doing this entirely wrong. I am definitely doing this wrong, but that's also another way to take this guy out. Alright. Oh, there we go! That's what you're meant to do. Oh my god. We're halfway. Oh! Okay, yeah, he's got a new attack now since he's half HP. He jumps really high in the air and yeah. Oh boy, come here, buddy. Come here. Come here. Whoa! 
Come here, look at him! Oh, there we go! He smacked himself! You're an idiot, dude! Come on! Oh, we did it! Yeah! Come on! Come on! Come on! Come on! Come on! Come on! Throw as many reds as you can up there! Leave him on! Leave him on! No! You know what? Come here, buddy! Come here! You're half health! You're not half health! Oh, come on! Come on, yeah! He's down! We did it! Holy crap! We lost a lot of Pikmin, but it's fine! The final ship part! At long last, I found the final part! My secret safe! And it's, it's, and it's full as ever! I'm glad I, that I persisted in my search without losing hope. Now I can leave this planet without any regrets. Maybe I'll even stop and pick up some souvenirs for my wife and kids back on Planet Hokotate. The secret safe. It's finally ours. We earned it. We got it back. We beat it. We may have lost a lot of Pikmin in that fight. But we got it. We got the final ship part. I didn't think I was able to do it in this era. <laughs> I didn't think I was able to do it in just today. <laughs> I thought I was going to get the puzzles over and done with. Maybe fight him a little bit, but not kill him entirely. We still have a little bit of the dead. Oh, come on. Come on. That is... Well, that was... That was it. We may have lost a lot of paper through the Emperor Ball Blacks, but it's fine. We got the final ship part, it's right here. Holy crap. We did it! If you guys can make it back in time, that'll be the end of the game. Wow. Alright, then I did not expect this. We did it. We actually did it. Ten seconds, that doesn't matter, we got it! We recovered every single ship part. I finally recovered every ship part. I can now return home to Hokotate. Well, there we go. Now this is pretty cool. Look at all of that. Many, many other Pikmin species that has yet to been discovered. 
But there were two down there that looked really familiar if you guys played Pikmin 3. A black and a pink one. We'll be covering that when we get to Pikmin 3. First, there's still many more games that we need to play. Like Pikmin 2. There we go. I did it. No, we did it. Well, here's the stats. Parts of... We found all 30 parts in 21 days. Surviving Pikmin of 455. Total Pikmin lost was 507. My personal best was 173. Pikmin ever... Total Pikmin ever sprouted was 2,346. Not too bad. Only ship was... Only when ship was completed when we lost that many. That fucking smoky prog caught me off guard. That should not have happened. Well, alright, so here are the list of the ship parts. All the ones in yellow are required. The blue ones are not required. So, the final part you would need to find is not required, The se being the secret safe. I, <laughs> I always found that quite hilarious. But anyway, let's have an end. Let's save. And let's go through the credits, because the credits are really good for this one. Oh wait, here we go. There's still many more to explore on this planet. Here are the credits. So. Thoughts about this game. I love it. I love this game with all my heart. One of my favorite Wii games of all time. Well, actually, it was a GameCube game, but in my instance, it was for the Wii. Pikmin will always be a special to me. It was one of the first games I got for my Wii long, long ago. And I had a blast playing it. I love this series. I love actually like seeing people play this game and being like all frustrated with like the mechanics, the enemies. The enemies were really well done. It, it, even like the layout for all the areas of this world was so well done. Even like the Pikmin themselves. They were really cute and fun to watch. But of course this game can be really frustrating at some times. Freaking lolly hops and smoky probs. But other than that, it's a fun experience. Pikmin 2 did step up their game, and it is a better game on the Wii. Actually, it's just one of the. Uh, Pikmin 2 is honestly the best out of the entire trilogy. Well, there's going to be a fourth game coming out next month. I, ha I am recording this in June, and this game, this Let's Play, will come out like much later. Because Mario Galaxy is still being um, uploaded, like, right now. I just wanted to record Le uh, Pikmin because I just wanted to play it again. It gave me a good excuse to play this masterpiece. And honestly, I am thankful that I showed off this great game. But anyway, let's just enjoy what it the end has to offer. Roll call! Here we go! Every single boss and enemy all in alphabetical order. Army Cannon Beetle. This migrant lith lithropod has developed a strong Karas. Oh crap. <laughs> I had to cough there. Oh, he's. That one's disgusting to look at. Waxy secretions form this creature's distinctive armored shell. The bread bug. And hey, a bunch of honey whisks. We didn't see a whole bunch of honey whisks in the uh, forest navel. This creature's thick hide protects it, it protect it from most attackers. Oh, hey, you jerks! I forgot about you. Burrowing Snagrin. The bluish hue of its feathers disti 
disguises it from... Oh, yeah, I don't know. <laughs> and puppet... Hey, Bulbulb's in the distant spring? What? Candy Pop Bud? Could this be the next step in Pikmin Evolution? Maybe. Pikmin themselves have many mysteries. And Pearly Clam Clam? You're in the distant spring? A uh, clamshell? That's what they're known as here? Oh. Well then. Oh, and these things are these things are horrifying to look at. Look at that! <laughs> Dwarf Bowl Bear! A bowl bear in an early stage of development and cycle, this specimen appears to be nearly fully developed. And more distant spring bulbs. Dwarf bulb. Although similar in appearance to bulb orbs, these belong to Oh yeah! Small bulb orbs are basically bread bugs. They're more it's more uh, touched upon in Pikmin 2. Emperor Bulb Blacks. This massive grub dog buries itself when hunting. Olamar, what are you doing fighting fighting a fiery blowhole with blues? This creature expels a combustible phosphor that ignites at moderate at moderate temperatures. Sweeping snitch bug in the uh, uh, forest of hope. This rare species uses its antenna as wings. That's pretty cool. Gulex in the forest navel. What? A watery, gelatinous membrane protects this creature's nervous system. Honey wisp in the distant spring. I'm not too sure if we there are honey wisp in the distant spring itself. This creature collects nectar for the larval waiting in its nest. Iridescent, but hey, the extraordinary bolt where it's not supposed to be. The extraordinary bolt is in, supposed to be in the forest of hope. Maybe this is all like showing off like early game stuff and Mamuda. Hey, see, look at that. Whoa, Mamuda. This creature seems fond of flowers, but only their decorative properties. And yeah, the impact site. Honestly, this song is such a banger. Hey, Puffstool! Wait, we can actually see it in action! Look at this! Oh, what? We can only... Oh. Many consider this walking fungus a delicacy. I'm not too sure about that, buddy. Puffy Blowog. Instead of breathing fire, this species uses hydro hydrogen to float. And there's the there's the there's the extreme oh, is that the repair type bolt? I can't remember what they're oh. Males are the purple ones and the females are the white ones. Sheer wigs! The males of this species are able to fly, but the females remain underground. That's why we don't see many oh. You! I was waiting for you! Though thought to be a Malformed larval Mamuta. Yeah. Oh, yeah, he tripped over. Oh, no, he ate him. Spotty Ball Bear. This rare subspecies of Ball Ball have a certain. In I'm not gonna even try and pronounce that. Oh! <laughs> I love that face! I love that! Oh! I'm gonna eat you! Water Dumple. You guys look gross. This aquatic creature is, cl is close relative to it of the bulb bulb. Yes, they are. And that ship part is not supposed to be there. Oh, they're called wall poles in OK. So they're known as wog poles and wall poles. You! You guys are jerks! Wally Hop. This creature's co coloration results from remaining sheltered in, in its cavernous dwelling. You again! Yellow Wally Hop. After evolution led to the development of its specialized jumping ability, this amphibian actually lost much of its ability to swim. And that is it. The happy end. Well, this has been a journey. I love this game with all my heart. And I hope you guys love this series as much as I did. Well, the happy end. Yeah, the happy end. Nothing more about that. That's everything we can do in Pikmin. Or is there?
there's still challenge mode to show off. So, this may be the finale, but in the bonus episode, I will be going over challenge mode. So, next time on Pikmin, I will be going over challenge mode and see what it has to offer. Thank you guys so much for watching this, and I will see you for the bonus episode. Have a good one, guys.